A proper spoil board allows you to cut through your parts without damaging your machine, while helping to secure your project by providing access for clamps and hold downs. To make a match fit spoil board specifically for your machine, begin by homing or jogging the head as far into the left front corner as possible. Zero this point out in X and Y, and move the head as far into the rear right corner as you can. Take note of the XY coordinates at this point. This is the actual working envelope of your CNC. Cut your MDF spoil board one inch smaller than the working envelope, and starting from the front left corner, lay out the dovetail groove locations across the side and front at four inch intervals. Jog the head one half inch in X and one half inch in Y. Then position the spoil board so the front left corner is directly underneath the bit. Mark the spoil board for the mounting hole locations, in this case aligned with the T-slot of the machine bed. Drill the spoil board for the mounting hardware. Quarter inch through holes with half inch counter bores 5 16 deep. Make sure the mounting holes are clear of the dovetail groove locations marked earlier. Nylon screws are used for mounting the spoil board with flat nuts connected underneath. Nylon screws won't damage your bits if you accidentally hit them. Flat nuts work well with most T-Track machine beds. And threaded inserts can be used for other types. Reposition the spoil board underneath the bit at 1 half inch X and 1 half inch Y. Then secure the nylon screws to lock the spoil board in place. Your spoil board's ready to be milled. In your CAD CAM program, create a box the size of your spoil board and draw a grid of lines at 4 inch intervals for the grooves. The dovetail cuts have to start and end beyond the spoil board, so the lines need to extend a quarter of an inch off of each edge. Like any match fit system, quarter inch relief grooves are milled 5 16 of an inch deep first, and before changing the quarter inch cutter out, a rabbit is cut all the way around the spoil board creating a known reference point at the front left corner. So even if your spoil board is not perfectly aligned, this reference edge will be. In your CAD CAM system, the same lines are used to program the dovetail cuts. These have to cut at the full 3 eighths of an inch depth in a single pass. But because of the relief grooves, any CNC can make these cuts easily. The reference edges are not cut with the dovetail bit. A well-designed spoil board makes all of your operations on your CNC faster, easier, and safer. Full written instructions for making a match-fit spoil board to fit your machine are available at microjig.com.